Howdy, this is Lemmy with Revzilla TV, here to talk to you today about Custom Dynamics Lighting. Aftermarket LED lighting is something you should be thinking about if you want increased safety and lower draw on your electrical system. Custom Dynamics has a pretty wide range of products. You're seeing a small smattering of what they offer here. Some of them are more universal, and some of them are very, very bike specific. So there really is a gamut of what things are going to fit. Uh, that also involves your uh, ability and willingness to fabricate some stuff on your own. Installation is not particularly difficult on most of these products. You're looking at a one to two beard install out of our three beard uh, maximum. Again, not really that hard for most folks, but it depends what you're installing, what you're putting it on, and how universal the product you bought is. Custom Dynamics has been in the LED game for quite a while. Their packages are compact, but they provide great illumination. It's very hard to not be seen if you have Custom Dynamics products anywhere on your bike. And I mean that in both a, hey, that bike looks really clean sense, and I also mean it in a, hey, I think that guy is stopping short in front of me sort of sense. Um, Custom Dynamics products are, I think, sort of nifty in that they manage to make your bike visually look smaller when the lights are off. However, once one of these lights is activated, all of a sudden you can't do anything but stare at it. They are really blinding. It's, it, it's great how, how much uh, attention you're going to draw with these products. So let's get into some of the ones we have sitting in front of me. So the first up is a fairly universal piece. It's a, uh, a taillight strobe modulator. What this is going to do is going to make your taillight, after this is wired up, it will stutter every time you hit the brake. You're going to see a, you're going to see a, a, a strobe or a modulation effect, which is great for grabbing the attention of somebody behind you who might be distracted. Somebody's talking on the phone, somebody's texting away. A lot of times they might not notice the fact that your brake light has just lit. However, if it's lighting repeatedly and in a strange fashion, um, it's usually enough to get somebody to kind of jerk them out of their days and concentrate on the fact that you're slowing down and make sure that they don't hit you. Um, these are fairly easy to wire up. This is one of the more universal products Custom Dynamics offers. One of the things I really like about this particular piece is on the back you'll see this knob, and that knob has 10 positions. And what it does is it changes the, the way the light strobes. So you've got 10 sort of patterns to choose from what you feel might protect you best. A lot of the more inexpensive units will just have one pre-programmed, but Custom actually lets you go ahead and choose um, which one you think is going to help be safest for you. I think that's really nifty. The the small size of this is definitely a benefit too. For those of you who are um, either building sort of a stripped down bike or just need uh, you know, a, a somewhere to stash stuff, those of you guys maybe running around on say a rocker, it's kind of hard to, to hide things on those bikes. This being so small makes the job a little bit easier. Moving to this product, I think this might be my favorite on the table just because of the wide variety of Harleys this thing fits. This is your standard square back taillight. However, this thing comes preloaded with a whole passel of LEDs in here. This thing is so unbelievably bright. Once this thing lights off, um, the differentiation between brake light and taillight is really bright. This is just a super great unit. You can see that this one is smoked. They offer both a smoked and a standard red one. So if you kind of want to go with the low pro look, incognito, you don't want people knowing um, that you're, you're flashing up your bike too much you have just the standard red housing but then these smoked ones too kind of give you that super cool guy look uh, they look especially nifty on a black bike they kind of just melt into the fender and you don't really tend to notice them too much these things are super duper cool they should fit a bunch of harleys out there Moving into some of the more specific stuff, you can see here I have um, a set of LED turn signals. And specifically, these are for Harleys. These are fantastic because these fit in immediately behind the turn signal lens. They have an 1156 style base. They plug right into your factory light housings. You really don't have to do anything more than remove your lens, replace the bulb, and pop the lens back on. And you're going to get super, super bright LED action from these things all within a stock housing, so you're not spending a bunch of money, you're not spending a bunch of time trying to make something work. One of the other things I think is super cool about this unit, when you're replacing turn signals on a bike with LED, a lot of the time the load is different. Now, because you're not drawing as much power from your electrical system, it, it confuses the turn signal flasher. The flasher doesn't know to flash. So what happens is a resistor needs to be wired in. Rather than you having to figure out what that resistor value is and wire it all in, Custom does that all for you. So these are ready just to plug in and go. You should be able to have these in your bike in just moments, and you should be cruising down the road now with LED-fired turn signals. I think that's a pretty cool feature. 
Moving on down the line, we have uh, fender tip LED boards. Those of you guys riding FL uh, Harleys, full fendered pieces, you know that those lights up front aren't very bright on your fender tips. These will light them up bright. And the really cool part about these is that they are going to be long lasting. LEDs last a whole lot longer than standard incandescent bulbs, especially somewhere like the fender. You're catching all sorts of water and, and road grime and stuff. Bulbs tend to die down there, plus the vibration just tends to buzz them apart. I know that replacing those happens a lot. And when you move to an LED bulb, I think you're going to notice that your bulb replacements are a lot fewer and a lot farther between. The final product you see on here too are these really nifty license plate bolt lights. These are again one of the more universal products. I really think these things are cool. They come in a multitude of colors. You've got amber and red and these can function as either stop, turn or tail lights depending on how you wire them up. Um, as you can see they're super low profile, super small. These just replace your license plate bolts and they're, gonna, they're going to provide whatever color it is that you select. Again an amber bulb will obviously show amber light, a red light will show red light. But the thing I think that makes them really, really awesome is if you turn to the side of the body here, you can see this cutout and that actually emits a white light. So this is kind of a dual function bulb and that it can serve as both a license plate light and either a stop turn or tail light, depending on how you've got it wired up. But it's just so small, it's barely even noticeable, again, until the thing is lit. And then it really tends to grab people's attention, both motorists and other motorcyclists who just see it and say, holy moly, that is a really bright bulb in a really small spot. I think Custom Dynamics offers a whole array of really, really innovative products, only some of which you're seeing here. However, my opinion is not the only one that matters. Click below, see what some riders who have this stuff have to say about it. If you have this stuff, let another motorcyclist know what you think of it, if this stuff is working out for you or not. If you've got questions about whether or not this is going to fit your bike or maybe how to install something, get a hold of us, cs at revzilla.com, or you can get us by phone, 877-792-9455. I'm Lemmy, I'm out of here.